you know, I, I just pop in and out. I, I don't, I don't have an introduction. I don't have a departure. And, and the reason I do that is because, because I'm, I'm like, uh, a thought. I'm like a thought that just pops in, and then, and then disappears, like, in, like, like a vapor. So my thoughts are, you know, they're, they're random. And um, so I try to gather them up. And uh, so this next thought that I have, right? Um, well, what, I think I said it before, but I'll say it again. When people are waiting for Christ to return, don't you know that the return of Christ is when people's conscience starts to become Christ-like. And also, as it is in heaven, so shall it be here on earth. But at the same time, it's, it's all about people waking up. And um, they're waking up to all the lies, including, you know, mainly... Cause that, cause this is how things are gonna change, and uh, it took a little while to, you know, just time goes by, you start realizing the way that things are gonna change is because the people in high places, um, not particularly the the leaders of the world, they're still they're still wicked, evil, right? But it's the it's the it's the people that, you know, the alphabet soup. You guys are the ones that. <clears throat> You're going to. Uh, you're already seeing what the truth is, and when all these events keep happening, too, right? Look, you have a job to do. You either have to lock me up for being a terrorist and then prove that I'm a terrorist. Um, you can't lock me up for being a CIA agent because I'm not. And you can't lock me up for being a terrorist either, because I'm not. But you have a decision to make. It's either one of those two, or I'm prophesying. And and to me, prophesying is taking the Bible, reading it, studying it, taking the world script, studying it, uh, doing a little bit of math. You know, go to a math school, science school. You know, combine, and y you'll learn. It's like the science of um, it's not it's not knowing science like the star, stars sun and the moon and everything it's putting together the script and the timeline is a science it's a science to doing it so when people are waiting for Christ to return and get raptured up out of here and leave I mean I you know Depending on how far your walk is with God, it depends on how awake your conscience is to, to know that Christ resides inside of you, your temple, the body of Christ. It's not that you're waiting for somebody to appear and um, <clears throat> and then take you away, you know, like, like Calgon. Nobody's going anywhere. The only thing that's happening is you're leaving this world. Yeah, you, you leave the world. As soon as you get raptured up out of here, you leave the world. And leaving the world is the way that it is now, not being part of this world, but being a part of the kingdom of heaven. So that's what it means to me, waiting on Christ to return. And then the Al... Alas Mosque, right? I just looked it up. I was saying that I think that that the one in Jerusalem with the golden uh, roof is going to be a target for uh, ISIS or wh whoever. Somebody that somebody is going to you know blow it up or firebomb it or, or shoot it up or something like that. And um, and then I. But I didn't know that it was called Al Al Mosque, and that's the that's the one that was that was the attempted fire or whatever on a, this on the fifteenth of April. 
which means it's going to get hit for good. That was a little, a little, you know, test because it's the most holiest mosque in Jerusalem, which means that is going to get bombed. And then in Iran, I forgot that I don't know the name of it, but it's I have it in one of the videos. That one is it Mecca? No, no, Mecca is one of them, but I, not in Iran, but in Iran. Uh, whichever one that is and they believe that's a target too and then so there's the two and then um, St. Peter's Cathedral okay, they're, they're the three major events that I believe are going to take place and then Guam right? Guam is going to be attacked by either one or two Iran right or um, you know Chin Chong Moon uh, North Korea leader he's shooting off missiles fire he's shooting fire images in the sky and um, so don't you know that the same thing that happened to the other one of the other fenced cities in World War II uh, Hawaii was hit and because Hawaii was hit that be that truly was the declaration that exact day was the declaration um, I'm not sure what caused it beforehand I didn't really look that up I know what caught I know what caused and started World War one and finished it and then, uh, I know what started World War two but I don't know what what was the reasoning before that like how May 2nd is the reasoning because Trump is choking you know Iran's oil production and Put sanctions on it, whatever, and that's going to create, that's going to stir up World War III. Uh, but the actual event itself, World War III, will happen. Um, I'm just going to say that it'll happen on May 21st, and that's that's the time where that fenced city, the other one, Guam, um, because it's one of the most protected. This is why it doesn't make sense when it happens. It's one of the most protected places. I think in the world. I don't know. I mean, that's why uh, that's why my my sister and brother-in-law moved over there, amongst that being part of his job to, to head over there. But there's a there's a you know a base right there um, in Guam. So I believe that Guam's going to get bombed by Iran, um, or Iran will. Be blamed for telling North Korea to shoot it off and and uh, and hit it, and then that'll because every they keep talking. It's like they got the same um, army gear as World War II, the same exact uniforms, and they're mentioning World War II the way it is. And and uh, Stephen James Deshawn is acting just like uh, Hitler is. You know the propaganda king, king of propaganda. Everything's the same, bowing down to the president. You know, like, you know, he's even though he's not in the mainstream media, but his, you know, it's like if anybody asks, "Hey, have you heard from Stephen lately?" <laughs> yeah. What he what hasn't been doing any videos? It, look, I hear about him every day. Every day I go on uh, YouTube every day I turn on the the uh, turn on the the news channel or whatever right well mainly YouTube because I get the news from there. When I turn that on there's Steve when I turn on another what AMT there's Steve when I turn on Rich from boss there's Steve because the strips are his because he's the one with all the knowledge of the Bible apparently so, uh, so yeah, uh, Guam is a fence city and it's going to be, um, it's going to be hit May 21st. That's going to be when Michael stands up.